What's going on everybody? This is Darren from Affordable Shoe Review. And today I am not here to review some shoes for your friends and you. Today, I am angry. So if you are new here, please go like, subscribe, and comment. I surely appreciate you for stopping by and checking out my video. Today's video is not necessarily a happy topic. I am a little frustrated and a little upset with StockX. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for continuing to support me and rocking with my content. Now let's get into story time about StockX. I am very upset, kind of angry. Customer service is absolutely trash. So let's get into it really quick. Can't wait to share this story with you guys and see if you've had any similar experiences to what I've had. So guys, I have had plenty of experiences with StockX in the past. Obviously StockX is one of the largest sneaker reselling applications that is on the market right now, if not the largest. I know a lot of people use Goat, a lot of people use eBay, but StockX is one of the largest, if not the largest, sneaker resale site that there is. Now, I have purchased things from StockX in the past. I have purchased quite a few sneakers from StockX, and I have never had any issues with purchasing something from StockX before. I have had one mishap before when I sold a anti-social social club hoodie. I received the payout for that hoodie and they actually sent the, pay, uh, the hoodie back to me. So instead of sending it to whoever bought it, they sent it back to me after paying me for selling the hoodie. So whoever, I don't know if they ever got that fixed. I contacted them, but I don't know if they ever got that fixed, but I was willing to send that hoodie back to StockX so they could give it to the rightful owner. Anyway, I have a new horror story with StockX, some customer service concerns that have really upset me in these past few days, so let's get into it. Now, today is October 21st, and I purchased a pair of the New Balance 2002R Vintage Orange from the Protection Pack on October 6th. That is 15 days ago, 15 days over two full weeks. So if you guys do not know what a 2002R looks like, this is the 2002R silhouette in the Water Be The Guide colorway. Obviously I'm a sneaker channel, so I do wanna show off some sneakers in my videos when I can. However, the 2002R vintage orange in the protection pack or the refined future pack, I'll pop up a picture of that up here so you can see it. I was very excited to order that pair because A, I don't have anything from the protection pack, and that is a super popular uh, pack of sneakers from New Balance. And two, the orange or vintage orange colorway would be perfect for Halloween. So I really wanted to wear that pair on Halloween. I have no idea if I am gonna get my sneakers by Halloween, even though I ordered them on October 6th. So now let's go into what is going on. So I placed an order for the 2002R vintage orange protection pack new balances on October 6th. That pair shipped on October 8th, at least based on what I could see in my email, you get an alert whenever the pair of shoes that you have ordered has shipped. So it shipped on October 8th. On October 10th, so only two days later, I received an email saying, your order will likely be delayed. Likely be delayed. No idea what that means, right? So I don't know if that means that they have received the package and they just haven't checked it yet or authenticated it yet. But based on what is going on, I'm gonna assume they haven't even received it yet. So two days after it shipped, likely to be delayed. They then sent me another email on the 12th, which was two days after the initial email saying, your order will be delayed. That is all that this relays in the email. All it says is your order will be delayed. Here's your order number. And then StockX talks all about how we pride ourselves on customer service and we have dropped the ball in this case. So whatever, right? If it says it's delayed, that's fine. However, I would like to know why or when I can expect something. All StockX sends is your order is delayed. That's it. So since the 12th, StockX has actually already sent me two more emails saying that my order will be delayed. But all of these emails are the exact same. 
It says, no action is required from you. We'll get your shoes to you soon. Your order's delayed. We pride ourselves in customer service, right? So I'm kind of upset because first of all, freaking tell me what's going on, right? Tell me what is happening with my shoes. Why is the order delayed? Is the package lost? Are you looking for somebody else to fill the order because the seller had fakes? Whatever it is, tell me why my order is delayed. It's been 15 days since I ordered and you are still telling me you haven't even received the package yet. So the part that has upset me the most about this entire thing is after 10 days of not knowing where my order was because StockX, all they'll say is it's delayed, it's delayed, it's delayed. I decided to log on to their live chat feature to chat with someone about what was going on with my order. So the first thing that you have to go through when you log into the live chat is the virtual assistant. So the virtual assistant is a computer automated system that is trying to answer your question or your inquiry for you. Now, obviously the virtual assistant was no help to me because it's not gonna be able to tell me where my order is. So I continued to say something like representative in the chat and eventually the virtual assistant said, I'm gonna get you hooked or connected with a live chat representative. So somebody would actually be talking to me. However, the virtual chat assistant connected me to what he said was a live chat person. However, the live chat person responded just like the virtual assistant did. So I think that they may not even have live people responding to you. They just say that they're live people because the, the conversation, and I'll post the conversation up here, was absolutely ridiculous. It wasn't like they were talking to me as a person. It's like they were responding with automated script responses, just like a virtual assistant would. So anyway, the live representative come, the live representative, quote unquote, comes on and says, we should be receiving your shipment soon and be on the lookout for an email from us in the next few days, however much that is, you know, in the next few days. So I respond back saying, I would like to know where my order is because you guys have not told me. And I'm also hoping to get these by Halloween. So if there's any way that I could get these by Halloween, I would like to get these by Halloween. And the response seemed like an automated response. It said, I will reach out to my team and someone will get a hold of you and send you an email. What kind of customer service is that? I mean, in all seriousness, what kind of customer service is that? I'm telling you my issue, you don't respond with any empathy whatsoever. You don't apologize for the inconvenience that you've caused me, right? I have spent money on this pair of shoes. It's taken you 15 days to not even receive my order yet. And all you're doing is telling me somebody will reach out to you by email soon. You've already sent me four freaking emails about how my order's delayed. So if you're gonna reach out to me by email and all you're gonna say is my order's delayed, that's not good enough for me. That's not what I want. So I don't know guys, I don't know what to say. I am thoroughly, thoroughly frustrated with StockX and the customer service. The fact that their automated chat teller, uh, automated chat client, whatever it is, transferred me to a live chat representative that acted just like a virtual assistant, that's insane to me. You've also sent me four emails that are the exact same and don't tell me anything. I do not understand from a customer service standpoint how this is beneficial for you or how it's beneficial for me as your customer. I have worked in retail settings. I understand what customer service looks like. I understand what empathy and apologizing looks like. This is not it. So you guys let me know down in the chat below if you guys have had any issues with StockX before. I know that there is a lot of stuff going on with StockX and fake shoes that have been passed through StockX. But man, you would think that their customer service would be at least decent with all the other crap that's going on with them. But nope, here we are with terrible customer service for a large company and your customers are just dumbfounded or at least I'm dumbfounded by the lack of empathy that you as a company have for me as your consumer. Anyway, I appreciate you for stopping by and listening to my story, please. Stay safe, stay blessed. We'll see you soon and peace out.